Today we'll show you how you can create a mesh that has different material channels for the Unblended 4. So basically after that you can add different materials to your cube. So for example that we have a red side, a blue side, a yellow side. And now we'll show you how to do it. First of all go to the material tab up here and then add as many materials you like. So for example I will add another one, then click on to new, then I will go to the pink one and then I will add a third one, new and let's say yellow. Okay, now go into the edit mode and select the part which should have the special material. So for example, I select this part here. This should have the yellow material. So click onto assign. Then I will click onto material 3. And I select, for example, this part here. And then I click onto assign. Okay, that's it. Now just export it. Open up down engine 4. And then, okay, let's start it up. And then try it out. So do a right click, import, go to your cube. In my case, it's called untitled, I think. Yep. Then add the cube to the level, scale it up or down as you like. And here you can already see we have three different elements. So now we create the material. So for example, say this here. Where is it? Right here. And then I will create constant 3 vector. And this should have a pink color. And apply. Okay, so let's try it out. Now we'll assign the pink color to this channel here. And you can already see here the part is pink. Then we'll assign this one here to this channel. And you can already see there's a third element. And of course, I can add another one. So let's create another material. Material and them constant and let's put this one here to let's say yellow and okay and now you can see now we have three different elements on our cube and you can do that with every mesh and that's a pretty basic blender function so yeah thank you for watching and until next time.